Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Mike JPG, and welcome back to my social media today in this video. I will be playing Call of Duty Black Ops 2, and I will be showing you guys a glitch that allows you to get a ray gun without having to get the mystery box. Oh gosh, no ambushing that. Now I'm going to go through the whole process of what to do. And it's actually pretty easy, if you think about it. First, you just got to put all the parts together. This looks like it might be good for something. So now you have to put all the parts together first. And you just get parts, whatever's here, whatever's here, you don't have to. Now I'm just going to go over here and build the part. Alright, so now, as fast as possible, we're going to get on a roll, because we want to get fast by about round seven. We gotta get moving quickly. Uh, it's good to build up over either exactly or over one thousand dollars because if you get over one thousand, about one thousand dollars, you can get one of my favorite guns, which allows me to survive for a long time. You can buy this gun up here up on the roof, which is a B23R and the cost is one thousand dollars. Or one thousand points. Now I just gotta It's a good thing to uh, face and 
press in the back towards the wall here, because if you don't, there's a chance that a zombie can sneak up behind you and kill you, and you won't know it. So it's a good thing to turn around when you're rebuilding barriers or anything like that. But when you're in the box depot and you're and you're building the uh, the uh, power source that I'm holding in my he head right now, uh, it you can't you can't face the other direction when trying to rebuild that. You have to face the uh, the you have to face the workbench in order to do that, which really sucks. But it's the way it is, and. Now that it's round five, I can get moving here. So, you have to face the workbench, and it really sucks, but that's the way it is, which is why you have to be really cautious that there's not any zombies around you when you're doing that, because it takes a while to rebuild them. So, you can take this time. I like the farm. I like when it gets to the farm, because then you can get off and search around the box without getting attacked by anything. And that's the time to search around the box to make sure there's no zombies. And then after you do that, it'll be about round five. Now, we only have two places to, left to go, so that'll bring us to about round seven or round eight. So you have to do the whole entire box course in order to get this glitch to work. Because you have to get a, you have to get a gun, at, which is going to be at the next stop, in order to do this glitch. Now this glitch that I'm going to show you guys is a glitch that barely anybody on the internet knows about, and I was able to find out about it, and there were only a couple other people on the internet too that were able to find that stuff. But now that you get here, it's, you immediately have to get on, off the bus because it's going to get a head start. Then you have to switch to this gun that you got at the beginning, because you want to trade this gun. This gun's good. So you switch to this gun, and this gun right here with the green dots on top, uh, the B23R, uh, I think that's what it's called, um, that's going to be your backup gun. But what you're going to have to buy is with this gun right here, you can buy this gun right here. So then now, now that you have this gun, you don't want to really use it. Cause you're going to use that gun to trade in for your ray gun. Alright, now that's the end of the round, because you can know that when there's a runner, because runners come at the end of the round, only one. I mean, only round. But once you do that, now we're going to have to go through the town, and that'll be the last stop. And that town, and the town is when you get to uh, get rid of the zombies that are chasing you in the back of the bus that you're not able to kill when you're on board. And it's a good time to rebuild barriers and all that stuff. Because you want to rebuild the barriers at the town because that's going to be the last stop before you get to the bridge. And the bridge is about really hard. Which is good because, which is good when you, uh, you, in order to avoid zombies getting to you on the bridge, uh, it's good to, um, end the round before you get to the bridge. Sit down on the bridge can just relax and not have to worry about any zombies really. And uh, and if zombies corner you on the bus, all you have to do is open the door when you're about to get up. You uh, get arrive at the bus depot again because the place goes because the bus goes in a circle. Uh, then you can just jump off as soon as you get there, even if the bus is still moving.
Now, the reason I wanted to show you guys the whole thing of the killing zombies and all that is because I wanted it to be entertaining in a full, a, a, a full length video instead of just like instead of two minutes of me showing you already with the gun already what you have to do. Because then it will it'll only be informational and not really the painting or anything like that. So, and it won't be full length, it'll only be a couple minutes long. Maybe only not even a minute. But, because it's really simple and really short of what you have to do. So this, as I said, this is a good time to get rid of the zombies in the back of the bus as they're coming. And in between, when you're killing zombies and there's no more zombies there, this is a good time to rebuild the barriers in between. Like here. And then you can get back off and, oh no, Alright, now that it's the end of the round, this is good because, as I said before, it's good to end the round before you get on the, before you get to the bridge, because the bridge is a very dangerous part of the map. Here. See, now we're getting to the bridge. Now the bridge is a very dangerous part here. And this is when all the zombies start breaking in. This is not what I planned, but what's happening? Oh no, they're all breaking in. Alright, I'm gonna open this door. I might have to run. I might have to run. I couldn't stay on the bus. So uh, that's not what I planned. <laughs> that's not what I planned. But oh no. Hopefully I can get there in time. Now I have to get to the side of this. And no, this is not what that has happened. No. No. No, why is it not working? No oh no, <laughs> the glitch didn't work. Oh shoot, I'm playing as Misty. All right, you can't do the glitch with Misty. For some reason, you can't do the glitch with Misty. And I just had to run that whole entire course for nothing. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. All right, so I'm gonna actually uh, pause here, and I will be right back when I get back, and I'm gonna pause this video and charge it. Because it's on 1% battery right now. So I'll be right back. Alright guys, so I forgot to say this. I'm back. So, I forgot to say this, but... The glitch doesn't work for Misty. It only works on the male char playable characters who are males. So, we're going to retry this and hopefully it works. We're going to take this gun out. We have to go to the side. Hit that and we get a ray gun. Voila. And boom, we got a ray gun. So we have to take the gun on the side of the shed, and we have to go over to the side of this Olympia that costs $500, and by then, you, if you use all your money, uh, you can, you'll have more than enough money. But you just go to the side. Now, I always made the mistake... And I didn't understand why it would, wouldn't work in my last Call of Duty Black Ops 2 Zombies Transit um, with the uh, music in it. In that last video, in that video, I had to, I went over here and I went like this, right in front of it, and I clicked it, and it wouldn't work, and I wouldn't understand, I didn't understand why, but apparently now I understand. But now I understand, because apparently, you don't go straight in front of it, because if you go in front of it, then you'll buy the Olympia. If you go to, then, 
because I would I had to pause the video and then I sh I unpaused it and I had the ray gun because I in between the clips I had to buy the, figure out why it wasn't working and then uh, you saw in the video I had the ray gun but I you have to go to the side of it right here in the corner and you have to pl press X and you have to hold X and you'll get the ray gun. It's really easy to use. It has uh, a lot of, um, it has like a lot of um, ammo. Here, let me reload because I got max ammo. And you can just go on your way, killing everything. But yeah, it only works if you play as a male playable character. It only works if you go to the side of it. And it only works if you have that particular gun on the side of the shed. But yeah, that's how you get a ray gun for free without having to find the mystery box. Because usually the mystery box isn't there in transit. In transit, the mystery box isn't there, so. So you can just, um, blast through levels like this. Uh, my high score, my highest level for using the ray gun is level 15. Never was able to get past level 15, because you have to shoot the ray gun like this. Twice. But yeah, it's really easy use. It's just like getting a ray gun from the thing, but it's a very, it's an easier way of getting a ray gun on transit. But yeah, that's how it works, and uh, yeah, so if that is the end of this video today, if you liked it, please like the like button, and I'll see you next video. Bye-bye.